Well, hello. It is your friend Tomas here with yet another Sugar Bridges demo video. Today I have, of course, the Sugar Bridges crossover blend pedal with the How Rust Ride bass driver pedal, which is an amazing thing just by itself. Um, of course, the most interesting thing about it, besides its tone, is that it doesn't have an input level control. It just has an output level control, and this one is missing its knob because the knob is a little messed up. But uh, the main thing about this one is it just sounds best with the bass plugged straight into it. So you know, let's, let's just show you that effect out. It's just... Um, I'm here with my uh, assistant, the ATK 5-string um, bass, with, which is now out of tune because of that lamp over there. Um, but anyway, she's working, and so... Whoa. Obviously, it's pretty awesome and designed for blending. It even has a direct out. So here's what I'm going to do. Is I'm not just going to put it in the loop because I, I, I want to feed it all the low end, all the low frequencies because it is that wonderful crunchy thing and it's designed for bass. However, I don't want to blend full range with it because I like the way the treble sounds. So I'm not going to use the send at all. Instead... The return is going to come from the effect. That's just the full range, everything. And the uh, input, which gets low passed and only passes the bass, is going to come from the direct out. And you're thinking, that's a little weird. I'm like, no, not really. I mean, yeah, yeah, it's a little weird. One of the great things about this is it still works as a bypass, so that's nice. Um, this is definitely an inverting pedal, more old school circuitry, and let me just show you what happens here. So you've still got the, the full range drive, and the crossover does nothing to change the sound because it's not in the path. However, it does change how much low frequency versus mid range you'll be mixing with it. Right? So, Settings just a little fizzy. Might be nice if you have, um, if you're running a dark speakers, the warm setting is just not interesting. But normal is about right. And let's see. Running almost a full range signal blended with it. Pretty, uh... 
So I guess compared to just a regular blend, <laughs> it's just even grittier. Because <laughs> you haven't added anything clean to the hive. It's just... Okay, that's a lot. That's a lot of uh, a lot of noise. Not necessarily a setup I'd recommend for writing little pop songs, but you know, I mean, maybe you'll have an inspiration. I don't know. I think it's that. Have a good one. <laughs>